What's up YouTube, thanks for tuning in today. If you haven't had a chance to yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'm here bringing you everything gaming and tech related that I can. Trying to provide good content for you. Today I'm actually coming at you guys with a uh, problem, and it's it's really not much of a problem. It's because it's not a bad problem to have. Uh, as you can see here, I have way too many games. And so, the hardest thing for me these days is actually picking what I want to play. So if you guys could do me a favor, I'm going to scroll through my list here of games, and I'm going to try to do it kind of slowly and in a manner. The list is really hard to scroll through, um, so I'm just going to try to pick a point, scroll to it, pause for a second. You can pause the video so you actually have more time to read the list. And uh, But yeah, I'm looking for suggestions. You know, If you see a game that calls out to you, or a game that you've played, or you want to know more about, um, drop a comment. Let me know if you want me to just play it, or if you want me to do a review, or what you think I should do with that game. Because I just, I can't be, I can't pick games anymore, you know. I have my, my crutch go-tos, uh, but there's so many games on here that I've never seen before that I just, I need to start playing and checking out, because I bet there's some awesome games to be had. A lot of indie stuff going on. So, let's see, I'm going to scroll down to there. So, poker, this is going to be tough. I gotta figure out where... Okay, Poker Night at the Inventory. So, next set of games coming up there. Uh, some of these, you know, some of these obviously I have played, even though they're not installed. So, you know, take that with a grain of salt. Um, obviously, you guys know how Steam works. The white ones I currently have installed. The gray ones are not installed. Um, but I have played some of these. Like, I think uh, this one... Is it that one? No. It was this one. Yeah, this one, you know, I played through. It's just not installed. It's it's classic point-and-click adventure game. It's actually really good. It's kind of funny, too. It's really worth checking out. I would definitely check this game out. Um, and the achievements, you know, to get all 34 wasn't that bad. I, I played through the game twice to be able to unlock all the achievements. Twice in 11 hours. I'd say I got my money's worth out of that game. But anyway, moving on, I'm going to scroll down again. Let's see here. That's what I'll do. I'll just click on the game that I need to go to next. Pause here for a second. <clears throat> um, I'm seeing if there's anything. Trying to use a pretty good game. Yeah, I haven't played a lot. Obviously, as you can tell, I only have seven achievements unlocked. But that's a good game I should play more of. This is good. It's causing me to pause and actually look at my list as well. Let's see here. That's a pretty good pause. You know, just long enough that you guys could actually pause the video itself to to read the list, get an idea of what's in here. I'm trying to keep it so this video isn't that long. I know if, that, if you guys are anything like me, the attention span just doesn't exist, right? So many games. As you can see, why it's hard for me to pick a game, you know. And when I think about a thousand games, I'm like, well, that's not that many. I can, I can pick a game out of that. But then you look through the list and you start scrolling, and it's, it's, it's very daunting. There's a lot in there. I Zombie. This game is pretty dorky. I need to keep playing that. That's another fun game. I should do a review on that. Some, you know, a lot of these could be coming from Humble Bundles. Uh, a lot are gifts as well. And, and then a lot are uh, sale purchases. You know, I shop the sales year-round, so, on Humble Bundle and Steam. But yeah, definitely need help picking games to play, and or review, you know. Sam and Max, those are good. I need to actually continue that story. It's tough, you get one game that ends up absorbing all your time. And even takes away from the go-to games that you have usually, right? 
the Stanley parable of, uh, <laughs> the only achievement I need is, um, the play for an entire duration of a Tuesday. <laughs> but, uh, that's a really fun, dorky game. If you guys haven't played that, the, the guy who made that is just awesome, and he's made a couple other games as well. Is that the bottom? That's the bottom. I don't know what the sequence is. But, uh, I acquired that, I guess, half a year ago or so. Um, so yeah, guys, that's my game list. So yeah, if you could, if you could do that for me, you know, make a comment and what you want to see. If there's a game you want me to play or review, let me know. And if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe and like and share button. Thanks a bunch, guys.